For this tutorial, we're going to learn how to do absolute value on our calculator. Now let's take a look at the first example. Here we have the absolute value of negative 10. Well, in order to do absolute value on the calculator, we need to first go to math, and then you can see that there's different tabs on the top. Well, we need to go to num. And then the very first option right here, the ABS in a parentheses, that stands for absolute value. So let's hit enter. Now we need to put in negative 10. Now when we do this, we need to be sure that we use the negative button and not the minus button. Because if you put in a minus where you're supposed to have a negative, the calculator may end up with an error and you will not get the correct answer. So in order to use the negative button, that's down here at the bottom on the right. And now we need to put in 10 and then close the parentheses. So now we're ready to find out what the absolute value of negative 10 is. So we just hit enter. And as we could see, the absolute value of negative 10 is just 10. Now let's just do one more example. So here we have the absolute value of 26. So let's figure out what that is on a calculator. So we'll go to math and then scroll over to the num tab and then we'll choose the first option, ABS. Now we want to do the absolute value of 26, so we'll just put in 26, and then close the parentheses. And now hit enter, we get our answer to be 26. And that's how you use absolute values on the calculator.